tonight, a family is mourning and searching for answers after their son is found dead. Emilio Valdez was shot multiple times and found in a local lake on Thursday night. Tonight, friends and family gathered at Warren Mott High School to remember him. Action News reporter Bethany Moore joins us live from Warren, where she spoke to loved ones about the memory he leaves behind. Bethany. Good evening. Now hundreds of people are still even out here now, and they gathered very early this evening to remember Emilio Valdez. A look back at memories. That was us at my backyard before homecoming. Before they should ever have to. He's the first boy that called me Mama P. Family and friends gathered at the high school he attended to remember Emilio. Genuine, silly, and handsome young man. The 20 year old was found dead in Osmond Lake on Thursday evening. Police say he had been shot multiple times. He was a good boy, he didn't deserve to get gunned down in the street. Nobody does. The family left with nothing but questions. Whoever did this to him robbed us and robbed him of the beautiful life he had in, ahead of him. But tonight isn't about anger. He was just a ball of joy, always smiling, always making everyone happy never fall with anyone. It's about remembering Emilio the athlete. He showed his love for basketball and football on the court and the field. Emilio the giver. My son couldn't walk, so we didn't buy the cap and gown. And Emilio loaned him his cap and gown, so my son, I can have pictures. Emilio who could light up a room. He could shift an entire room of people, a crowd of people with his energy and with just his aura. And he may be gone, but that light's not out. To Emilio Valdez. Emilio. Emilio. A very touching tribute for him. Now the family just really wants to stress, if anyone knows anything surrounding Emilio's death, please come forward to police. Reporting live, Bethany Moore, 7 Action News. Just so 